Tonight, a new warning about some of the most popular prescription drugs in America, treating heartburn and acid reflux. They're now also sold over the counter. While it's already known they're linked to a risk of fractures and infections, now a new study finds they can have another serious side effect. NBC's Ann Thompson has the details. Can't afford to let heartburn get in the way? Stopping heartburn is big business. Zero heartburn! Sold as Nexium Prilosec and Prevacid, more than 15 million Americans shelled out over $10 billion in 2013 for the prescription versions of these drugs called proton pump inhibitors. Now a new study from Johns Hopkins says these acid-reducing drugs may increase the risk for chronic kidney disease 20 to 50%. Cleveland Clinic kidney specialist Dr. Cheryl Cancel is treating Kim Hinkle. Kim had normal kidney function in March, and then blood work in August showed kidney function down to 30%. Kim was taking one of the over the counter versions. On a hunch, Dr. Cancel had Kim stop and her kidneys improve. I was lucky it was caught early and that we can do something about it. For over the counter acid reducers, the FDA recommends they be used for 14 days and no more than three times a year. For the prescription versions, the package insert recommends for most conditions the pills be taken for up to eight weeks. Pills are not the only answer, food is the answer. Dr. Jonathan Aviv prescribes the drugs, but insists his patients also avoid acidic foods like berries, chocolate, and anything with caffeine for 28 days. You can change your diet and reduce acid production and actually heal your own body by what you're eating. The makers of these drugs say they are safe and effective when used correctly. That and diet can keep stomach acid where it belongs.